Okay. Maji Niohai, Water is Life. This is me. I grew up in Kenya, a country where smallhold farmers feed the nation. 80% of food is by, produced by them, and there are 6.5 million people, and they're the ones hit the hardest by climate change. In the recent years, we had a four-year-long drought. The harvests collapsed, millions faced hunger, and what used to work with nature now needs new solutions. So, farmhold, small farmers have, uh, need artificial irrigation. But most of them use diesel-powered pumps, which are expensive, polluting, and cut 70% of their income, while diesel prices are still rising. So we took a different approach, simple, robust, and accessible for everyone. Together with labs and engineers, we created River Pump. The River Pump is a self-sufficient water pump powered solely by the flow of the river, meaning zero operational costs for the farmers. It delivers 10 to 30,000 liters of water per day, irrigating 7 to 21 hectares per week. It further runs 24-7 and can be moved along the river, hence also be shared by multiple farmers. And all of this completely CO2 neutral in service. We take it one step further. We combine business opportunities for Kenyans. So, at our river center, we manufacture and pre all the parts for our river pump. And then, local independent distributors called riverpreneurs buy them at cost, pre-assemble them on site, and rent them out to the farmers. Um, they pay $70 per month for use and maintenance, managed directly by the riverpreneur. Hence, um, revenue is shared. 40% um, stays with the repreneur, while 60% plus a small license fee goes to us. But um, in this way, also we can include Kenyans as true partners. And what does that mean for the farmer? Farmers can double their income, freeing up money for healthcare, education and reinvesting into the farms. We can, uh, we can help local communities by also saving 6,500 kg of CO2 annually per pump. The first pump was installed in Sio River in Busia, but across Kenya we have 2.5 million farmers cultivating their land at rivers, all potential customers. The demand was clear from the start, but not only from farmers, but many others reached out who are in need for reliable water. Our first prototypes were placed strategically at a family farm, a fish farm and an NGO. All of them training farmers in sustainable agriculture. So far, we have installed three pumps and we have um, delivered 3.8 million litres of water. We have raised $69,000 and built strong uh, partnerships. Further, we have established the Kenyan Centre, um, which is called the River Centre. Um, and we secured 70 LOIs, but our scope is expanding. In the last week, we established that river pump can also be used as drinking water. This means not just irrigation, but access to clean water for rural communities. Winning the Halt Prize will jumpstart our scaling process, meaning 200 sold river pumps in 2026 and 3,000 river pumps in 2028, generating revenues of over $4.7 million. Our team is multidisciplinary across Kenya and Germany. We combine technical expertise, local experience and a shared passion for sustainability. The founders, Anton, our CTO, is a mechanical engineer and has designed the river pump from scratch. Matt brings the expertise from economics and social ventures, while I am a cultural anthropologist and I speak fluent Swahili, the local language. With River Pump, we enable everyone to transport water from A to B at zero cost, because Marginal High, water is life.